Like three and then he's gonna let three go and then... Oh, no. You ready, Ben? <laughs> What's up everyone? Welcome back to a brand new episode. It's gonna be another adventure video today. Ben is still here from the last video, so this is actually like the second day of us being together, but I've released the video a week later. Yeah, we've got an adventure video today. And what we are doing is we're going on the longest toboggan in Switzerland. So as you can see behind me, there's a lift. So basically we're gonna take the lift, go all the way up to the top, and then as you can see here, for example, there's like uh, the toboggan trail. So the toboggan trail goes all the way up this mountain here and winds around. So we're going to go up with the car, take the toboggan all the way down and see how it looks. Because I think the views are going to be really, really cool. So the toboggan in is actually in a place called Kurvalden. I'll write that on the screen for you in case you don't know. In Switzerland, of course. So yeah, we bought our tickets online. Uh, all the websites, uh, everything, all the prices are in the description of this video. If you want to check it out, then just click down somewhere in the description and you'll find it. And yeah, we're gonna go through the gates now. Ben got the tickets. And we're gonna make our way up on the lift. <laughs> this is gonna be so much fun. Let's do it, Ben. Cool. Yep, thank you, man. <laughs> Let's get it. Hey? Oh, is it? Sweet. Awesome, man. Look at that. <laughs> so me and Ben are on the way up. So nice here. Yeah. Beautiful. Yeah, it's so nice and fresh. Real cool. It's a long way up, you can see. So here's the part of the trail, obviously the end of the trail that goes back down that way. But the start is way up there. I think it says that you start at 1,750 meters and then you come all the way down. So that's why it's the longest uh, toboggan in Switzerland. So yeah, pretty exciting stuff. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, it's gonna be fun. Yeah. Okay, we can't go up here because it's a style. Oh yeah. So while we're going up, we're also looking for places where we can go on the e-bikes as well. Make a bit of a day out of it. But yeah, first things first, get the toboggan done. Crazy, look at the corners on there. It says it's got, yeah, it says it's got thir 31 corners to go around in this one. <laughs> well, we've made it. So, get her up. Oh, is it? Oh, sorry. <laughs> So aside from the toboggan itself, there's actually like a, a rope course that you can do as well, which is really cool. It gives a, a different vibe to just kind of coming up the mountain and then going back down again with the toboggan. 
so all of the prices can be found on the website guys like i said it's in the description if you want to check it out but i think this is so cool what a there's not many places that you can do stuff like this you know good idea today so we're gonna we've basically got some plus tickets which we got a, a, a meal with that as well so we're not too sure if it's actually this restaurant here or the restaurant down at the bottom hopefully it's the one at the bottom otherwise yeah we're not too hungry right now yeah so we're not hungry at all because we just had some breakfast before we came <laughs> So anybody who is planning on doing this adventure, just know that the restaurant is at the top. It's not the restaurant at the bottom. So if you want to do it, then come up on a, either get two, two trips up with the cable car, or yeah, <laughs> be prepared to be hungry. <laughs> I mean, I'm not even hungry. I'm just going to eat for the sake of it. It's a point wasting yeah, it. <laughs> yeah. yeah, so we've decided we're going to just eat anyway. We're not really hungry, but. We don't really want to plan on coming back up again after the toboggan. So. Unless we cycle up. <laughs> unless, we, unless we cycle up, but uh, I don't know, we'll see. So, for a big adventure calls for two big beers. Yep. Cheers. Cheers Ben, cheers Another brother. Adventure. Hell yeah. Starting it off with a salad, I've got the French dressing. Ben's got the Italian dressing. I'm an Italian salad starter, and then an Italian salad main course. Yeah, vegan options. <laughs> Ben's a vegan, so he's starting off with a salad, and then he's moving on to a bigger salad. So <laughs> I'm not, I'm not a vegan, so I'll be on the meaty stuff. But yeah, not so bad. All right, second portion. Look at that. So it's called flash case. So basic translation is meat cheese I guess <laughs> but it's not cheese it's just some nice meat and chips and afro salad <laughs> afro salad check that out but yeah for for the price that we paid for 39 francs for Switzerland prices it's pretty good we've got a salad to start I've got this as a main meal Ben's got a big salad because he's chose the vegan menu so the beers aren't included so for the food and the trip up here on there on the cable car 39 francs to me that's quite a good deal for switzerland yeah, yeah, oh yeah so we're gonna get this eaten and then we're gonna make our way down to the queue the queue is really big so i think we've got a bit of a wait but should be fine we've got all the time in the world so yeah we're gonna get this in our stomachs that are already full and make our way down <laughs> so food's done we're making our way down to the join this massive queue that's down there that's the beginning of the the line it goes to the left and round yeah i'm excited it's gonna be so cool this and look at the view as well how beautiful is that hey. nice let's go so just over an hour we've kind of made it to the entrance yeah it wasn't exactly an hour yeah, yeah. It's been an hour. so it took about an hour from the back of the queue where we were now to get where we are now so it's quite a long time to wait but yeah so excited for it now it rained a little bit but yeah so you always have to push forward until you want to break you gotta lean forward as well it looks like like three and then he's gonna let three go and then oh, no. go on Benny boy Benny's getting in <laughs> safety first Ben yeah. so Ben's in I'm just waiting for mine now and we're gonna go we got the blue one. Boys in blue. You ready, Ben? <laughs> Here we go. I think I've got to wait for. I've got to wait for Ben now. Ben's off. Thank <laughs> you. Here we go, everybody. So these things have got brakes on the side so I can use them, but off we go! Oh my god! Whoa! Jesus! This thing is crazy fast then! Whoa! 
So I think these things go max at 42 kilometers an hour. Brands in. Close. Nice. <laughs> this thing is so fast. <laughs> Catching up to Ben now. Ben's being a slow bugger. <laughs> Come on, Ben! It's actually really, really long. Awesome. The views are so cool. Whoa. So I've not really used the brakes at all. It just goes by itself. Unfortunately, there's, there's some people like in front of us, so I'll have to start using the brakes now. Fuck's sick. Yeah, we're not allowed to stop on the tracks, I think. Yeah, I know. Beautiful, though. Look at that. I'm just going to slow it down here a little bit. There we go. Should be alright now. Brakes are off. Let's go! <laughs> Jeez. So cool! Look at the mountains behind as well. So you've got to keep a 25 meter distance, it said there. Whoa! Oh my god! Jeez! No braking. No stopping. Hey! <laughs> Have to stop again here for the chicks. I think this is the most annoying part about it, is just having to stop. Because I like to go really fast. <laughs> Are you looking, Ben? Yeah, waiting for the chicks. Waiting for the chicks. It's good though, isn't it? Yeah, really good. <laughs> oh, bugger off. How can you help? Okay, let's go. Ben's still there. Let him get a bit further. We're actually almost at the bottom now as well. Right, Ben's got some distance, let's go. <laughs> oh my god! <laughs> I've like not used the brakes at all on any of these corners, so it just sticks to the, it sticks to the tracks really well. I kind of feel like it, in some sections it automatically breaks for you. I'm not too sure if that's just the... Whoa! I don't, I'm not too sure if that's the, the toboggan actually automatically breaking or not. Because it has got a brake light, so it's got a little bit of electrics inside it, so... It could be that it automatically breaks. That's it, 
ladies and gentlemen, the last stretch. Wow, that was such a cool experience. Whoa, so cool. That was amazing, dude. Nice, we're coming back in to land. They go pretty, pretty fast, don't they? Yeah, I know. We got stuck behind. Oh. <laughs> yeah, same, same. If you had it like to yourself, it'd be so fast. Like I barely even use the brakes, and it, but it kind of felt like it automatically does it. Oh, it does. It's, yeah. I think some sections the rails go thicker. Yeah. <laughs> so we've done it, guys. We actually made it down. That was such fun. That was really fun. That was more fun than I thought it was going to be, actually. So. Yeah. So we literally came down about 1,700 meters, 750 meters all the way down. So. That was absolutely awesome guys and I hope you enjoyed watching this video. Yeah, I'm probably going to end the video there. We might go looking for some mountain biking trails but I'm going to not video that. I've been videoing the last two days so I want to kind of just enjoy it. But yeah, thanks a lot guys for watching. If you like this kind of content and you want to see a bit more adventurous kind of videos then leave a like on the video, subscribe to the channel and yeah, I'll see you next time. Cheers guys.